just growing up in the projects, man, just your everyday typical just life, man, thug life, street life. I seen everything, you know what I'm saying? And even though I wasn't raised to, to be like that, that's just, that's what I wanted to do. And that's what I did. I found a way, you know what I'm saying? How was you when you kind of start gravitating towards the street life? Um, I say about the age of 14, I started being real curious about pistols. And uh, I caught my first pistol at 14, me and my cousin, Lloyd, rest in peace. You know what I'm saying? Um, I ain't know nothing about them, you know. It just was something I wanted. And that was my first pistol, actually was the 25. But at the same time, you know, I was kind of familiar with them because, like, you know, all the hood niggas used to give me pistols to hold, and, you know, while they sit out there on the block and hustle because I wasn't hustling yet. I, I didn't start hustling until I was, like, 15. I started trying to sell weed in the school halls and, you know, shit like that. And uh, I didn't start trying to sell work until I was 16. And shit, from there, I mean, it just wasn't no turning back. Mm -hmm. So you basically had a pistol before you even start getting the money. Yeah, absolutely, That's where man. Trying to take up from, huh? <laughs> Us on it at the, a little bit later. Hey, so it's crazy because uh, the names. It's like the first hood name that I ever had was Killer Tay. Mm -hmm. You know, like all the hood niggas that start calling me that. But then I had one of the old older homies in the in the in the hood that started saying Grit and Tay. You know, cause they see how I was gritting, how I was hustling. So now I'm killer Tay, I'm gritting Tay, you know. But then, you know, I had my South niggas, they start saying Tay the Hustler. You know what I mean? So now I'm Tay the Hustler, you know, and all that. And see, the ride of Tay came in like, oh, five. You know, it was kind of crazy because I'm chilling with my, you know, five one niggas, couple homies from, from the fog and Niggas just came with it, man. We sitting there, we listening to Rich. I can't really remember what Rich song we was listening to, but it was just like, oh man, you know what? I think I'm you. You ride a Tay, and, and ride a Tay Bonnie, and some shit the nigga said, and just roll with it, man. And just that's what who I was. Who was that that gave you the name? I want to say. I want to say that was Chicken that gave me that name. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? He just out the blue. We sitting there. We just smoking about 20, 30 blunts. We just, we blunted. You know what I mean? You know how you just sitting around. And niggas this just. About what year? This was in 05, man. You know what so I mean? That's, like, that's when that handle came. Yeah. Like, actually, like, yeah, Chicken the one gave me that name, man. He just, he just flat out just said it. Like, you know, we used to be on that on Ride of J. Clyde and shit back then. So, you know, I mm -hmm. Like I was, that was like my favorite mob figure. You know what I mean? He just came with it, like Ride of Tay Bonnie. You know what I mean? So like, but all my North Side niggas at the time, would they still call me? You know, Pillar Tay, Green Tay, all that shit. But just so the Ride of Tay just you, stuck. 